the whole post-apocalyptic thing runs deep through most of our music actually weirdly enough there are very few chemtrail songs that don't somehow involve references to like the end of the world the apocalypse people living in horrible harrowing hovels Mia is obsessed with the apocalypse she loves thinking about it I've been kind of obsessed with the apocalypse for my whole life because I used to have nightmares about nuclear war then it just so happened that the world kind of drifted into a kind of apocalyptic <laughs> set of circumstances by good fortune which <laughs> which we now <laughs> are singing about in an apparently topical fashion i'd say the main theme in this one is the whole transgender transition thing so like the two main singles were deranged and headless pinup girl deranged it's kind of about the experience I had of people questioning my sanity at a time in my life when I thought I was being the most sane I had ever been um, in deciding to take control of my life and just live in the way that I wanted to and to certain people that seemed like I'd gone crazy. When other people doubt you like that it's very hard to hold on and be convinced that you're right and everyone else is wrong. The sound of the band is predominantly garage punk, psychedelic, 